Hello, welcome to Morris Money, where we give you stock tips in under five minutes. I'm your host, Morris Willie. Today, I'm giving an update on Party City because you guys really enjoyed the video Friday, so I thought I'd give an update. Today's video is sponsored by the subscribe button. Go ahead and subscribe to Morris Money so you never miss out on the latest stock market news, should you buy videos, should you sell videos, and the latest information on your favorite stocks. So don't forget to subscribe to Morris Money. Today, the stock reached near highs of 50% as investors have been preparing for the company to file for bankruptcy. Now, I've seen a lot of positive sentiment around the stock. One place I like to go with stocks like Party City is Stock Twits to see what people are talking about with the stock. And market volume has been up 50% for the company and sentiment up 1%. So both positive indicators for the company. While there's no official filing yet, for bankruptcy, it's pretty much certain. According to inside sources, Party City wants to negotiate new terms with bondholders to retire old debt and clear the way for future operations. As I said in Friday's video, the insiders say that Party City has brought in Alex Partners, again, apologize if I'm butchering that name, as a restructuring advisor. This alongside the debt negotiations point towards the company likely using a bankruptcy filing to renegotiate its business before coming out of bankruptcy. Now, as we've seen in the past couple months and years, investors love buying in to bankruptcy companies. Why? I'm not too sure, but companies like Hertz saw a massive spike when the company filed for bankruptcy. So the same type of investor sentiment with buying into bankrupt companies is probably what's happening with Party City. If so, it's possible the company's shares could see greater gains ahead after the bankruptcy filing officially. However, that could also be followed up by a massive drop if investors decide to dump the stock. Another crazy thing I saw today, volume for the stock was 52 million. To give some context, the average volume for Party City is around 6 million. So this should tell you alone that the company is getting a lot of attention from investors. Another thing I looked at, which I'm not sure if I covered in Friday's video, is the company has short interest of about 15% right now. And looking around, the company has about a 40% chance of squeezing. Potential squeeze targets are around $1. And Wall Street currently has a price target on the stock at $2. So who knows what will happen. I just wanted to give an update on how the stock is doing because again, you guys seem to love the video Friday so might as well make a follow up to it today. Let me know your thoughts on Party City below. Investor sentiment must be good because I've seen a couple people comment on the video that they were buying in in hopes of a bigger rally. So good luck to everyone. Please don't take this video as financial advice and thank you for watching Morris Money.